Hi folks, it's Kim Willis again. Another little message for you today, a mini lesson you might say. Why posting ads, free ads, in Facebook groups sucks. That's the heading. Why posting free ads in Facebook groups sucks. And I'm talking about those spammy kind of groups that you've probably seen. Uh, most people who are online marketers have seen them before. And, um, you know, I just want to point out a couple of home truths here. The first thing is that uh, they can work in a limited way if you do a lot of it. If you do a lot of it. And when I say work, they work on the basis that you may get some leads. You may get some leads. But here's what I've found, and believe me, I've tested all of this. It's not like I haven't tried it. You know, uh, all of the positions that I've arrived at, all of the positions that I hold today, are based on the school of hard knocks. I've been there, done that. Now, if you want to spin your wheels, post an, post an ads in groups for the next 12 months, well, go for it. But uh, you won't be any better off. You may be worse off that much farther from reaching that, uh, that much further from reaching your dream and your goal. Hey, time is running fast. We need to work smarter, not necessarily harder. But back to the point. Uh, what I found when I was posting ads in groups is that I, I did get a lead or two here and there, okay? Um, but I decided after doing it for a few weeks that it was an absolutely marginal activity and not worth my time. Not worth my time, um, particularly when I did get a lead and then uh, I engaged with that lead. It became increasingly apparent that the quality of... Uh, leads that we get from that activity is very much on the low side. Uh, very much, we're talking very much about desperate people looking for desperate solutions, okay? And um, if you want to build your business on the back of desperate, broke people, well, go for it. Here's another thing. Even if they've got a little bit of money to join your cheap, buy your cheap program, or if, or if you're in a network marketing thing, join your cheap program, assuming you're in a cheap one, because that's about all they'll be able to afford. Uh, but if you do get one or two people joining and paying a bit of money and you make a little bit of pocket money as well, uh, guess what? Most of them will not do any work, okay? So you just made a little bit of pocket money, one off. And number two, most of them will quit in a couple of months. Because uh, what I found was that uh, the vast majority of these people uh, have no loyalty. Uh, they uh, do not understand the meaning of the word commitment. Uh, they're always looking for no work ways to do the business. I, I think, in a way, some of them are a bit deranged, to be quite honest with you. Uh, really, uh, I think some of them are a bit deranged. But uh, in virtually in every instance that I encountered, they were low-quality people, uh, looking for no work ways to make money. And of course, that is a myth. That is a total myth. So, uh, you, build your, you build your business on the back of these kinds of people uh, who are going to last maybe two months with you and then they move on to something else. Okay? They have the attention span of a gnat. And if you've ever seen a gnat, you know damn well those things. Man, they... <laughs> they got no focus. They got no focus. They're a bit like a monkey. You know, monkeys are all, all, all over the place like that, right? Monkey, monkey brain, I call them. Uh, that's another thing I say. But, uh, yeah, so it, it's, it's not smart. It is not smart. You've got to think more strategically and more long term. You've got to think on the basis that, hey, I want to build a business that produces sustainable, ongoing income. Sustainable income. Income that keeps happening and preferably keeps building. Okay. And uh, you're not going to do it with uh, those people. You're definitely not. Because you'll, it's like a leaky bucket. You keep putting people in at the top end and the, uh, the, the people who've been in, joined you two months ago, they start dropping out. Then you've got to put some more in the top end just to kind of mark time. You're not moving ahead. Take your eye off the ball for a couple of months. What happens to the remnants of your business then? Disappears. It's gone. Finished. You don't have a business. You never did have a business. All right. Uh, so uh, let's get real here. Let's build a business that revolves around us, our brand, our value, and take a more of an independent stance. If you're a network marketer, okay, have your little network marketing thing over here on the side. But long term, much better off uh, selling affiliate products, 
you're not recruiting, you're, you're selling products that have real value, um, or you're selling big ticket products so that when you make a sale, you, you make a grand, you make $5,000 or whatever. Hey, all this stuff out into the future, sometimes, uh, you know, with team building, etc., uh, teams fall apart, etc. I'd rather get the money today, get paid today. Or leverage a skill, do some coaching, do so. You want to get out of the rat race, you've got to look at the best ways to generate income now. And then also build sustainability for the long term, which always revolves around the, uh, your brand and the audience that you're creating. Because your audience will follow you, they'll, they will take on board what you're recommending, and often they'll, they'll do business with you, okay? Irrespective irrespective so so that's it don't waste your money on on uh, traffic that costs a small fortune and delivers low quality results such as solo ads as a rule there are a couple little exceptions and don't waste your time your effort your mental your mental energy on uh, posting ads in groups that's it that's it okay enjoy laptop lifestyle group that's the community where we teach people how to grow businesses organically, build audiences and tribes, and we know that when we have a warm audience, people are much more likely to do business with us. That's it. That's the key. That's the key. You want higher conversions? That's how you get it. You want a higher average sale value? That's how you get it. That's how you do it. All right. If you're not already in the Laptop Lifestyle group, please join it. Uh, I, we don't accept everybody, but you know, we, uh, may at least submit a request, and we'll check out your profile, etc. And uh, if you're already in it, hey, make it number one, elevate it, go into uh, settings there, and make it one of your favourites. This is Kim Willis. Bye for now.